What's up guys? Be Red, Porter Jet Ski Adventures. Today uh, we're going to do a little bit of Meet the Host. The podcast I'm going to be doing is called Talking Jet Skis with B Red. So I figured probably should get you guys acquainted with me and where I come from and what my background is and such. Uh, so let's just jump right into it. I'm born and raised in Minnesota. Moved to Florida when I was 26. I uh, came here because, to be honest with you, I was sick of the cold, and always since I was younger, we'd visit here on vacations as a family and stuff, and I always drew to the ocean, so I knew that someday I needed to live by the ocean, so here we are. Uh, big into motocross, uh, race motocross, uh, outdoor hair scrambles, stuff like that for probably 10 years, maybe a little bit more with the Florida Trail Riders. Uh, after that, kind of started slowing down. I've always been into motorcycles, four wheelers, all that, and uh, just kind of started slowing down with the motocross. My body was just kind of getting tired, so bought a boat, enjoyed a boat. You know, I still have it. Um, one year for my birthday, my daughter had bought a used jet ski. This was about two and a half years ago. She brings it down to Matanzas, and she's like, "Hey, listen, you got to check this thing out." You know, and I'm like, well, "I've never tried one." Even coming from the land of 10,000 lakes, I'd never ridden one up until then. So, with a little bit of hesitancy, I get on it. And, uh, I've been addicted to it ever since, to be honest with you. I took my Honda Grom about a week later, traded it for a 97 Sea-Doo GTI. The ski was super clean, thought it was great. Let me tell you something I didn't know. Check the carbon seal. I was way too new at jet skis for any of that information. And it sank first time out. So, long story short, ended up needing a motor, put a motor in it, just got tired of doing the repair it all week to ride it on the weekends. And I bought a Spark, rolled that around for about six, maybe eight months, and decided that me and my wife needed new, brand new skis, just warranties, let's just get it done. Um, so, we did. We bought two brand new GTIs. Um, she's got the GTI 170 SE. I've got the GTI 130 SE, which I have tuned now to the 170, so at least it's, it's you know similarly fast. It's definitely doesn't seem to be exactly the same, but uh, and that's kind of the rundown on me. And I just I've gotten so big into the community itself, um, all about meeting new people and uh, going on rides with new groups and getting my content out there, which I'm extremely new to making YouTube content and live streaming and all that is, is all extremely new to me, but I figured, you know, I'm, I enjoy it, might as well give it a shot. It's not like I'm trying to make a million dollars doing it, I'm just trying to have fun. Um, even though the fun is definitely cost money, but whatever. Uh, other than that, what I'm hoping to bring to you in the show itself is I'd like to bring, you know, interviews with riders. Um, I ride a lot with North Florida ski riders. I kind of help get that group going um, with a friend of mine. And um, I guess I'm going to do a lot of interviews with people in that group because they're super close to us and, you know, you'd like to get to know them a little bit better on a more upfront basis I guess. Um, I'd also like to do some interviews with some of the Florida ski riders, maybe get Randy on here at some point. Um, I got the chance to meet him when we were in Key Largo. Seems like a real cool guy. I've been following his stuff for years. Um, another one I'd like to get with is June from June's World. Um, also, you know, just I like his content. Albion, I'd like to maybe get her on here. Her content is amazing. Um, sea Roach TV is amazing, you know, get all, if I'd like to get all of them, be able to get on here and kind of get, you know, just get their take. I know other people have talked with people and of course they've asked questions and all this, but I mean, maybe my questions are different. Maybe not. Maybe it's a different audience base. Either way, I mean, it's just, I like to give it a shot. Uh, I'd like to get some, get some product sponsor people on here to, uh, talk about their stuff, you know, um, Let's get some, maybe we'll get some mechanics on here and the mechanics will tell you some do's and don'ts or some, you know, some things to check out if you're buying used skis so you don't get burned like I did and, uh, 
you know, that kind of stuff. I mean, that's that's kind of my goal for the for the show is just to kind of get with other people and get you guys with other people so that everybody can kind of just come together. I mean, it's it's awesome when you get. You, we, we did the Key Largo excursion. Uh, we probably had maybe 40 or maybe 40. I'm going to go with 40. Let's just say 40. 40 people from North Florida ski riders down there, right? Representing North Florida um, at, a, at a Florida ski riders event. Now, if you, that's quite a, quite a few. Now, you get all them people together and, and everybody's making relationships. I mean, the jet skis can have. Can bring you to making friends for life. I mean, I have made some amazing friends out of just the few years I've been into it. So I like to bring that to people. And also, product awareness. Um, we took a friend of ours, and I and I will do this for anybody that wants to do it. I'm I'm totally down for it. You know, you buy a jet ski. Nobody really. They give you a generic rundown of gas break here you go you know uh, we took a friend out we got her acquainted with the water got her comfortable with it got her comfortable with the markers and everything you know how to read the channel markers where to go where not to go and that kind of thing what to do in a group how, how to distance to stay away from people and stuff these are things in my opinion that should be addressed for new riders and you shouldn't be afraid to ask for somebody to say hey look could you give me give me a little quick rundown on how this works or you meet me on the water maybe take me on a little one-on-one -on -one. and again me my wife and also a friend of ours we will 100 percent do that for people and i think that's important so i'd like to touch on that in the channel um just tons of different things that are jet ski related and maybe even some things that are not maybe vehicle maintenance or whatever i mean I just want to get into it from this my my point of view. Get questions answered, meet people, and just go from there. Uh, so that's kind of the rundown on me um, and what the channel, you know, what the not the channel, but what the show is going to be about. The channel that I've got really is just video content from the rides that we go on. Some of them are uh, rides just me and my wife go on, you know, just to kind of explore. Some of them are going to be group rides. It's just going to be a bunch of different stuff. I mean, stay tuned. The content will get better. I mean, as people, you know, when I first started out, my first video versus my videos now, ten times, ten times better. So if you stick around, I mean, it's just going to get better. The content's going to get better. We're going to, we're going to grow this, and it'll be great. Um. So for now, what I'd like to really get out there is I appreciate you guys taking the time to watch the channel, subscribe. Uh, hit the like button on videos. I mean, you guys are great. You guys are what makes me want to do this. And also, I give a shout out to Ice Mule Coolers. They hooked up, they hooked me up with some some awesome coolers. I think everybody should check them out. They are fantastic for on the jet ski. Not only are they a cooler, but they are a dry bag. They float. The the Ice Mule Boss Cooler we have has three waterproof pockets in it that, I mean, I the first time out to try it out, I threw a cell phone in there, sunk the bag, and it did not get even a drip on it. Um, so, that's a product definitely you should check out. Um, I'd like to give a shout out to Applied Graphics in Ohio. They hooked me up with all graphics on my vehicle. Uh, hooked me up with some GoPro to do, GoPros to do some footage with. Uh, fantastic company the best quality decals that I've seen if you need some graphics definitely check them out and also st. John's power sports they're in placa uh, they keep our skis running well and making sure warranty stuff is taken care of uh, they got huge inventory so definitely definitely check out st. John's power sports thanks for checking this out and stay tuned for updates on the first live show appreciate it